The following video might not be suitable for everyone. Viewer's discretion is advised. Hey, my you, you know where I watch. Alright, viewers and subscribers, my name is Dan Skiller. Yes, me there again. Big up and respect to each and everyone, is it? Alright, so many times me see videos on social media that shows altercations between vendors and police officers within the country of Jamaica. You see me? And it pained my heart to see those kind of videos are those kind of situations. You see me? Because in my point of view, vendors are hardworking people, just like the police. You see me? Yeah, I don't really like to see those type of persons clashing because in my point of view, those persons are hardworking people to me. You see? Now, I have a video I'm going to present to you. And this video is going to show how two persons had been arrested by the police within the country of Jamaica and one of those persons is said to be a vendor see now according to where and when this video had been posted on social media it is said that the incident happened sometime within the month of May the year 2021 somewhere within the parish that is known as St. Catherine that is within the country that is known as Jamaica see now I'm going to present the video to you, my viewers and subscribers, but I'm going to tell you from right now that in this video, you can hear yelling and shouting and the police used force to arrest those persons, you see? Objects had been thrown at the police as well, viewers and subscribers, you see me? And if any of you, my viewers and subscribers, know where or when the incident happened, you can leave your comments in the comment section of this video and let me know where and when you think the incident happened and so on all right you can let me know what you think overall about the video or the incident you see me now before i present this video to you this is a warning that some of the scenes in this video might not be suitable for everyone viewer discretion is advised now here's the video take a look listen and observe
So I talk about viewers and subscribers. Them things that I talk about, you know? I mean, some of the times I wonder if the situation can't be dealt with better. See? Look, I understand that uh, there's a thing that is called illegal vending. And I would like to encourage each and every vendors out there to do their vending the legal way. Just to avoid any problems with the law. You understand? You see, do your best to make sure say, when you're doing your vending, you do it the legal way. See me? Go through the necessary paperwork. Do it whatsoever way that is the legal way. And avoid getting into trouble with the law. You see me? Yeah, I'm going to encourage each and every vendors to do that. You see me? I said to you. Now, I know that uh, some of the times getting certain legal things done can be difficult. I understand that. But I would not and I will not encourage anyone to use that as an excuse to do anything illegal. So, may I make sure so I say to each and every vendors out there, do your best to make sure so you do your vending legally and avoid getting into trouble with the law. You see? Because you have a time when police will go out there in different, different places within the country of Jamaica and remove vendors from off of the street or try to stop illegal vending from happening and some of these incidents somehow had been recorded and put out there on social media and that's how i end up seeing some of these videos are getting somewhat of an understanding about the incidents you see man say i see the next thing again too you have some police too me know say them are doing job but some of the police them do their job in such an aggressive way. See? Communication is a big part of police work, you know. Communication, you know. See me, I say? A lot of times if police would just relax and talk to the people, you know, a lot of things can be avoided too, you know. Communication. Is a big, big part of a police officer's job, you know. Yeah, man. See me? I remember an incident where a police officer, along with other police officers, got in our town and destroyed some shops and stalls, you see me? And even one shop where me know from his little boy, me know that shop there. All that shop there get removed, you know. Big, big man up in a age, you know. Where I do the selling right at a little spot there for maybe about three decades. A police officer where somehow move come to that station. Right? Because you know the so police get transferred from different different stations. And this one come at that station and him and a team of police remove all of the vendors them. I mean I tell you, you know, people. It was a misery to see how some of the people them who had been vending for so many years had been removed. Their livelihoods had been taken away. And you know, sir, that man we may have talked about, that man, in take it to heart. And we get information and say that man became ill. See? Anyways, them said that it was illegal vending. I don't know what can be done about that. You see me I say? Anyways, you know, me just uh, tell you what I think about this whole thing. You know, me just present the video to you so that you can take a look at the video for yourself. And you can let me know what you think about some of the things that have been shown and said in the video. You understand me? Is it? And, um, you know, big up and respect to each and every one. And until the next time, if you're new to my channel, don't be afraid to click the subscribe button. My name is Dancer Skiller. I want to big up on yourself. Yes, it. Hey, my you, you know where you watch. Dance, dance, dance. Yeah, man. Hey. hey, yo, Skiller. You are watching Dance on Skiller. Tint.